I thought the ball game was played. You had two uh, really good starts with two pitchers that uh, pitched at a high level with uh, Locke St. John and our pitcher, Bradley Wallace. I mean, obviously, both are very good. Um, we, uh, we tended to, to make some miscues in the field and kind of flip the lineup one more time. Bradley had to kind of work through it. He kind of just grinded for us out there today. And the thing that really showed up, I think, was uh, when you get to the fifth on, he went one, two, three, four times in a row, five, six, seven, eight. That really helped our offense kind of get back into tempo and try to create some stuff instead of being on our heels. And it seems like this tournament, we've been on our heels almost the whole time. Uh, you know, I, I thought early on I uh, I was kind of tipping my pitches early and they were kind of queuing in on it and getting some hits off of me. And then once uh, Stuart Levy came out and uh, told me that they were keying in on it, I mean, it was it just kind of flowed a little better from there. And uh, I mean, I know that, you know, we had a couple errors behind me, but at the same time, I trusted the guys behind me and they made some great plays towards the end of the game for me. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty much what we're trying to do is have a quality at bats. That's uh, the motto for our offense. Um, no matter what's going on in the game, if we don't get the break or whatever, just have quality ABs and try to string them together and then uh, get runners. Because earlier on, we are having some bad luck. And, uh, you know, it just takes one hit. That's what we say. It just takes one, one guy to get it going. And then after that, uh, we can do, do our best from there. Yeah, I mean, that's just how baseball is sometimes. Uh, you know, a guy's doing great on the mound, and uh, it just takes one thing to get the whole offense ignited and get going. And uh, uh, I can't remember who it was. I think it was DJ got on for us and sparked us. I mean, he's been a spark plug all year long, and uh, that's, just how, that's just how we got going to, tonight. Yeah, exactly. It's such a quick turnaround. You just have to flush it, move on to the next game. And uh, that's what we were saying, you know, flush it, come out today, give 100%, have fun with it. I mean, uh, it could have been our last game, but if you have fun, that's all you can ask for. <laughs> well, I mean, honestly, uh, Coach Dickinson just came up to me and asked me if I still felt good. I mean, after the fifth inning, you know, just getting in my groove and kind of going with the flow. I mean, you know, of course, I'm going to say yes. But, I mean, you know, I, just, I was just trying to keep going out there and uh, giving our team the best chance to win possible and throwing up as many zeros as I could. Well, we, we did have a powwow. Bradley didn't know it. You know, we talked and uh, kind of a senior moment for Bradley because it's, uh, you know, he went one, two, three, three innings in a row. And we really felt like they weren't taking really good swings at him. And they were at the bottom of their lineup. And this was the moment to extend him. This was the time to do it. Um, it was really critical that he got one, two, three because it led off with a number nine hole for Morgan. And uh, that was even better for us. So uh, that was kind of the conversation we had going in that eighth, ninth, and we knew we were going to go to Morgan. We just didn't know when. 
Uh, once that eighth was completed, it was a no-brainer. Well, it's huge. You know, Bradley was in a uh, do or die situation last year, so he was he had kind of known this situation. And, uh, you know, for us, we knew that, uh, you know, really there's two teams that really make out well the first two days. Bottom line, there's two teams that feel good about everything. Um, you know, we just want to be able to push it to the next day. We talked about trying to get to the 630 game. That was our short term goal and move from there because you can't win a tournament in one day. Um, but, you know, I'm proud of the seniors because if you look at what happened, Maggio gets the RBI hit to tie it. We have an eight-inning great ball game pitched by Bradley Wallace and the senior Morgan Croft comes in late. So three guys that are seniors really helped us today in the elimination game. Well, I think we're okay for tomorrow. I mean, this is kind of a three-game set. We got some guys that pitched. Uh, it does give some guys a little bit of rest. Um, you know, we have some guys that are fresh. Um, the teams that we're going to play are going to be on their third guy. So it, it becomes a little bit more equalized now that we get to the next game um, because the team that's playing later tonight, that whoever loses, obviously gets done late. Um, so it's almost like, hey, it's a – it's back to almost neutral. We're both one and one to go play. The teams that sit well are 2 0. The two teams are 2 0. Any questions for the coach? All right. Thanks a lot. Okay.